Alright guys, Brownman again bringing you more Madden 2010 achievements. Today we have a shitload. We are going 9 achievements today and we're going to first start off with the online achievements. And uh, today I had some help from fellow community member RealDeal211, also known as James. But unfortunately the first footage I had of us getting two of the online achievements got kind of corrupted. So I'm just going to do a quick little uh, review of that here. You want to go to Xbox Live, create session, invite friends for if you're going for the online achievements. Go to unranked co-op and make sure it says five minutes in all pro. One of the achievements you have to do online is to throw a lateral. This is me doing it on single player, but this is what a lateral pretty much looks like. You run next to a player, hit left trigger, he throws it back. Now you just pretty much got to recreate that online with a friend. I did that, but like I said, footage got messed up. Here's the second achievement, which is uh, setting up a pass, or throwing a pass to your online partner. I throw it to James, he runs the route perfectly, and there you go, touchdown. So that's two achievements right there. The last one is for simply completing an online co-op game. Whether you win or lose, it doesn't make a difference. So just do the lateral like I just showed you, and just do a, pass like, a touchdown pass like that, which may be a little difficult, but not impossible. Just be persistent, just like that. And here you can see me and him flipping out in the party chat. And this is his online profile, his uh, gamer tag rather, the real deal 211. Send him some love. He's a great member. All right, next we got three achievements here. So go to play now. Um, for the sake of making things easier, like I did as you saw in the online uh, touchdown video, I'm gonna go against the Lions and I'm gonna use the Patriots. Figure the worst team against one of the best teams. And uh, once I pick the Patriots, you're going to see I'm going to make sure I'm on all pro difficulty and uh, the minutes set to five. But I'm going to pick the uh, Packers Stadium and put the weather to uh, heavy snow because for the, uh, the Frozen Tundra achievement, you simply got to win at Lambeau Field, which is the Packers Stadium and freezing weather. And on top of that, there's two more achievements I'm going to go for. Sprint two-minute drill and Super Bowl MVP-like. Sprint two-minute drill requires you to win a game while losing uh, while losing with uh, less than two minutes left in the game. And Super Bowl MVP-like is to throw a touchdown pass with less than 30 seconds to take the lead. So this is just me showing you what the stadium should look like once you, uh, once you set all your settings right and everything. As you can see, it's snowing like crazy. And I don't know if you see the big G in the middle for the Green Bay. It's pretty much the Green Bay Packers symbol in the middle. But all right, as you can see, less than 20 seconds on the clock. I'm down by three. On the defense, I'm just simply picking field goal block, and I've just picked a random pla uh, pass play. And you can see there's one receiver on Wes Welker on the left side with the uh, second controller. I'm just going to move him out of the way so I can make this much, much easier. So I'm going to hike it and throw to him quickly or else I'm going to get blitzed. Or excuse me, I'm going to get sacked because they throw a blitz at you. Pass it. He's wide open. So just run. Do a little body slide across the snow. That's a cool little flip there. There you go. Super Bowl MVP-like. I'm just going to show you the achievement right there. Like I said, catch a touchdown to take the lead with under 30 seconds left. And, you know, kick the field goal, doesn't matter. Now this is just me running the clock out a few seconds later to show, to show you me getting the last two achievements for, I believe it's uh, 60 Gamer School. There you go. Frozen Tundra and Sprint 2 Minute Drill. Alright, the last three achievements we're going for are Nano and the two Fumble achievements. Uh, look what I found and fight for the Fumble. But first, we're going to go for Nano. Now for Nano, it's important that you change the settings over here and go to Penalties and turn off Offsides. You can do it with Offsides turned on, but Offsides turned off makes it much, much easier. Okay, so that's just me showing you the settings. Go to Play Now. The teams don't really matter. I picked the Steelers and the Cardinals, of course, because they're the default teams. For um, defense, for this it doesn't matter what play you choose, but on offense you want to go to run, do an outside handoff, and a uh, halfback stretch. And the nano achievements, re uh, the nano achievement, excuse me, requires you to tackle the quarterback before he hands off a pass. So that's what the pass looks like. As you see, I would have, you have plenty of time to sack the quarterback before he hands off the ball. So I'm just going to move uh, Timmons a little more to the right here, then hit A and tackle him, mm, just like that. 
And when your defensive line and there you go, achievement unlocked Nano. Also, if you want, you could turn unlimited rewinds on, so that way if you uh, mess up, you can do it again. Alright, now the last one we're doing here is, uh, look what I found, which requires you to win a fight for the fumble in the end zone. So for the off, uh, the defense, you want to do a man blitz, any man blitz, you know, doesn't really matter. And for offense, you want to do a run, then go to pitch, then halfback toss. You want to have your defense focus on the halfback. With offsides on, you want to move your defender right there. And I don't know if you saw what just happened there. The quarterback threw the ball, it bounced off my defender into the end zone, and then the fight for the fumble thing came up, which you can see right there, which is pretty much the button mashing competition, and you're doing two controllers, so you do it by yourself. There's the rewind thing if you mess up. And there you go. Just make sure it bounces off. Uh, worst case scenario, it's going to be an interception. He's going to run it back in. And there you go. Fight for the fumble, and look what I found. Two achievements. Or excuse me, nine achievements in all. I'm exhausted. AchievementHunter.com. Peace out.